I'm here today at Alders Farm Fishery for the fourth annual Joseph James Law Team Championship. I'm joined by the man behind it all, Andrew Settle. Andrew, an exciting day ahead, I think. Yeah, fantastic day ahead. Um, we've got a fantastic venue here. Um, they're really uh, going to put on a fantastic day. We do what we can at Joseph James Law to provide a really professional fishing day for everyone. It's our fourth year. Uh, fantastic uh, that we're uh, still able uh, to get such a well supported event. We've got some good new teams here again today. Obviously the hot favourites have got to be the defending champions, Preston Innovations. Yeah. Um, the same three lakes as last year being used. Um, what do you think is going to be needed to win today? Do you think it's going to be a, a good match in terms of weights or do you think it'll be trickier in areas? I think there'll be some tricky areas today. I mm. think they'll, the, the hot favourite pegs on the bottom lake are going to be 1, 2, 30, 29 and 28. Mm. Uh, the match will be one off one of them. Uh, I'm pretty confident of that. Um, on the top lake, um, it's a moody lake. Uh, there could be some low weights on there today. Some people may struggle, uh, particularly people on the dam wall and in the corners where there's not too much space. Uh, but it'll make for a really interesting match. Absolutely. It's going to be a, a humdinger. So folks, we're going to head out onto the banks now. The anglers have just got set up. Andrew's got to get to his peg and get fishing. And we'll, uh, we'll see how the match pans out. Today I'm on Oak Lake and this is the specimen lake at Alders. It holds fish up to actually 40 pound um, and I'm in a corner so can't complain with that. Unfortunately I've had to get the pole out because they said I might catch them down the margins when I was hoping for a nice bag and wag day. Um, but yeah it looks lovely, great banter already going on on the lake so it's going to be a fun day. Um, the Guru team drew quite well I think. We've got Pete the meat, he's on the one by the calf, he's on a really good peg and I think Bobby's drew all right as well. And the other two boys are pretty happy. So yeah, looking forward to the event really. So. Hi, I'm Simon Fry. I'm here at the Joseph James Law team event. It's been a fantastic event over the last three years that Andrew Settle and his team have put together. It's one, there's some really, really good anglers here. Fantastic teams here. Um, we've been here every year and we, it's one we really look forward to. So well done to Andrew and the team. And of course, Alders Farm, fa fabulous fishery. Um, team Garbellino's draw today, I'm here on the Specy Lake Peg 1, uh, normally Darren is on here but he's had to go to work today, uh, so um, I'm here, fancy this draw, it's a, a nice looking peg, uh, it's one of the few that's got a feature on the lake, got the island over here, so obviously that'll be my main gambit, and I've got a really nice looking edge down here, and hopefully some of those big carp that live here will, uh, will catch later on. So uh, I'm happy with where I am. And thanks to Glenn Picton, uh, debutante, for drawing me this peg. So cheers, Glenn. Um, Glenn has drawn on the uh, Pines Lake at the top with Pete Black. Um, I think they've got mediocre draws, pretty good, you know, decent draws, average draws. Uh, we've got Lee Newson down on um, Ash, and Lee's on a flyer. He's our venue expert, all around nice guy. And Lee, I'm expecting to do really well. So come on, Lee get it done and then Les Thompson, Les is in the corner right at 14 now Lee doesn't think that's too good but we'll see Les is a quality angler and I'm sure if anyone can get the best out of it it will be him so uh, I think we're quite happy overall with our draw and fantastic event whatever happens today we'll enjoy the day and it's certainly as I say it's one we really look forward to so let's go. So I'm Julie I'm fishing for Joseph James Law Ladies Team England today slight problem though in that there's only three ladies in the team 
Um, everyone else is at work, so we've got Joe Roberts, who's the coach, and Jason Roberts, who was coached this year in South Africa. He's fishing with us today. So yeah, three women and uh, two guys, but there we are. Here today at Alders Farm, I've drawn peg six, I think it is, on pines. Pellet and maggot, and if they don't want pellet or maggot, then they're not going to have anything. So trying to fish long, maybe shallow, shorter line for the bream, hopefully, and the skimmers, and then hope for some carp rock up right down the edge uh, late on and can empty it on that line. So fingers crossed, Tom. Hi there, I'm uh, Greg Wellsby, uh, part of the Royal Singles team we've put in this year. It's our first year. Um, I've never been here personally myself, but we've got a decent draw on paper. Um, maybe one draw, peg nine on, on this pool here, Pines Lake. Um, maybe not so uh, favourable, but other than that, we've got a decent draw. Um, peg looks nice, I've got a nice end peg. Um, great events, the quality of anglers, the standard of anglers here is incredible. Um, you, at the draw queue this morning, you've got um, England internationals, ex England internationals, the England youth team, uh, England's women's team, so really strong uh, competitors this year, um, and hopefully we'll, we'll do ourselves proud. Joseph James Lord do a great thing running this event each year. I mean, he goes well out of his way to put this on. He gets all the uh, brands together, including the England ladies team, the England junior team. It really, really is a great event. Hats off to him to put all this effort in and, and put a day on like today. This is what fishing needs. Gets more people into fishing. There's plenty of spectators walking around as well. So it's a really, really good and exciting day. Can't wait to get the rigs in.
Uh, we're going to start with the section and lake uh, winners and then we'll move on to the uh, top three teams. So, we're going to start um, Ash A, section A, fishing for Joseph James Law, Grant Albert with £181. Well done, mate. Thank you. Cheers, thanks. We're splitting that, mate, by the way, because I took peg 20 up the top. Um, and again, uh, Ash, section B, fishing for Joseph James Law, Gary Thorpe, £146, one out. In Oak, we had um, a fantastic um, catch from Joe Roberts today. I think he deserves a round of applause. £53 of perch, not one over a pound. But you don't get any money for that, I'm afraid. So, um, winner of Oak, winning the section and the lake, Simon Skelton with £92. Well done, mate. Well done. And Pines, section A. Greg Cooper, £118, four ounce. Well done, mate. Well done. Thank you. Winner of B section on Pines, Will Reynolds, £117, two ounce. Cheers. So the overall winner of the match is Grant Albert, £181, two, bottle of champagne. Don't share that. <laughs> well done, mate. Okay, going to move on to the winning teams now, and I'm just going to just going to do the top three. So in third place, and I'd like all the team to come out. If that's all right. Is Joseph James Law in second place with 20 points? Is Team Gabellino. Well done, mate. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you very much. Cheers, mate. Well you. done, all right. Cheers. Come on, boys. Cheers. 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 And overall winner on the day, winning a cool £1,000, and more importantly, the JGL Championship Winners' Trophy, is Preston Innovations. Well done. Well done, Andy. Well done, Westy. Well done, Pete. Well done, mate. Before we do off today, um, as you know, Joseph James Law sponsors the England ladies team. Um, there's not many companies outside the England sector that put something back into the sport, so to speak. So, um, you know, our, our work in the trade, I know how few and far between there are. And I know the England ladies appreciate it as much as, as we all do. I'd just like to invite Julie up um, from the England ladies team who's got something to say. Um, yeah, just on behalf of the team, um, and on behalf of Sam and myself and everyone today, uh, this is a trophy that we won in South Africa in February, which we'd like to present to you to keep and have at your offices. Oh, you? thank you very much. Thank you. There you go. Oh, thank you. All right, cheers. Yeah, thanks cheers. very much. Thank All right, thank you. So I'm here with the captain of the winning team and a magnificent performance from you as well today. Thank you. You won it last year, defending champions, Preston Innovations. Yep. Going into today, you obviously must have been confident. Yeah, well, we, we'd fished the venue quite a lot. Yeah. And we won the Winter League on here. When it goes a little bit cold, a little bit cooler, uh, Alders is well known for massive weights. But when we have had a few cold nights, a bit of rain going, definitely knocks it on the head a little bit. And although everybody's information they get is about how strong the, the venue is and big weights they catch, but as we fish it through the winter, when it starts to turn, we feel like we just have a little bit of an edge. Yeah. Because we know how it responds during the winter and what happens when we have lots of rain and we've had some rain over the last couple of days Tom so we felt the harder it fished it gave us a little bit more of a chance you know because some fantastic teams here I mean you've got to look at the line up here today there's some brilliant anglers here today strong teams from Guru strong teams from Maver you know but we just had that little bit of local knowledge which is which is a big thing absolutely you know? so just talk us through the tactics I mean obviously three very different lakes um, different tactics required. What was the plan going into today? Um, well, Ash Lake, we know this big one, very important on the draw. The draw is so important on Ash Lake. We've been lucky enough to have someone on peg two, which is a very good peg. Unfortunately, 
when there's lots of commotion, we have lots of people going around, sometimes the fish push out from peg two. But on, normally it's a great a great draw. We've had someone on peg two. Rob Dizak's been on there. He's come back with six, seven points today. Um, Pete Arch done a brilliant job over from peg 20 on over on 25. Shallow water. Um, the fish have been up in the shallows. So we didn't draw. We tried to avoid the bottom end. Mm. And I think that's probably what's given us the extra point over Garbolino today because they've had... Paul Les has been down on peg 14 on, on, on the end where you don't really want to be. So, I mean, their scores must have been really good. Yeah. And Les being on a, on a, on a bad area uh, on the whole. So, you know, credit goes to Garbolino today. I mean, they've, we've beaten by one point, but they've had someone in a really bad area. That's Ash Lake. Moving on to the middle lake. I've been on the middle lake today, Tom. It was simply a case of, we know it's full of perch. I mean, we've seen Joe Roberts had 53 pounds it's of perch. incredible weight from Joe, wasn't 53 it? pounds of perch today. Absolutely incredible. The plan was chuck it out so we can get a carp straight away. If not, let's get your head down and catch some perch. I've got my head down today. I didn't draw a very good carp area. I knew I was going to get beaten by the carp pegs. But I've put 31 pound of all perch in on the scales and it's got me seventh in the section of 12. So I was happy with that. Uh, and then up onto Pines Lake, two guys that fished it all through the winter, Richard Farrow, Andrew Raymond, been brilliant through, through, through the winter league. They're so good at that commercial fishing and they've both come back second in the section on a very out of sorts up there it's, it's been a bit patchy for everybody so they've uh, Andrew's had 60 pound of silvers uh, which has boosted his weight so they know the venue up there so they know how to attack it when it goes a little bit difficult so yes yeah, worked out great for us so brilliant so we're pretty honored to win it again well to win it twice and I mean Black Horse in this area you know I'd have to say you're probably the top team in the Northampton yeah. Milton Keynes area aren't you yeah. um, in terms of the respect and it's easy to see why total dominance on the venue well <laughs> as i say we do fish through the winter tom um so the lads know we say we won the winter league convincingly last year and then the guys know it you know we've got some great commercial anglers in the side now we've gone away for originally we were an outside and and the anglers that want to do a bit more fishing now seem to be commercial minded so we've taken some great commercial anglers on now and uh, they've proved it today and reap the rewards very well done We'll thank you very you much, year. Tom. Let's hope so. Title. Thank you very much. And thanks, uh, I will say, thanks to Joseph James Law and Trevor and everybody at the fishery. It's always a great competition and thanks a lot. Thank you. Well, I'm here with today's match winner, Grant Albert. A superb weight, mate. Yeah, we've had a great day, mate. It's 181 pound. Talk us through it. Um, well, obviously, to, to, be fun, to be fair, I was going to be on points. And yeah. when we looked at the draw, they said, right, we'd rather have you on there. And then we'll try and catch what we can on there because it was a good peg I've been on today. Yeah. 28, where it's quite shallow over there. Um, so I started off at five metres. I plumbed up at 13. There was probably f three inches of difference, to be honest. So I thought, well, I'll stick it out at five metres. Plumbed up down the edges. Anyway, I started on loose feeding fours, the six mil on the hook, and just went off like a train. Yeah. I, I reckon I had 75 pounds in the first hour. Yeah. yeah. You know, it was really good. Obviously, they did start to just back off a little bit, but because it's a shallow, I mean, it must be two foot deep. Yeah. Just foul looked a lot of fish. I reckon I've, I mean, with weight, I've had a brilliant weight and I probably put under a pound back. Yeah. You know, just kept coming off like, but. Uh, Do you think that's a shallow water, then? Because everybody's had that problem today. Yeah, I think it is a shallow water. Obviously, mm. you know, when you're throwing, I was only throwing fives and sixes, but even that, it's, you know, you're getting, because they're so hungry, they just want to get to it. Yeah. Um, yeah, you get, you get, just get too many fish in your peg, even though you're only feeding like five and six pellets, but. Yeah. It's just the way it is, you know. But luckily, I've had enough and kept enough on the hook to win it like you know so uh, it's been brilliant it's been a great day awesome fished really really well all over i mean 50 pound a perch off you know joe roberts had yeah but you know, it's been brilliant it's a great it's a great event to be honest you know it's the fourth year i've fished it now yeah um but yeah it's great great atmosphere great lads and you know andrew as i say he's not even in the fishing industry um and for him to put on a show like this is fantastic yeah, absolutely you know, so and you'll be back next year to defend your title certainly will so you well, mate. Cheers, mate. So there we have it, Andrew. Another fantastic day. Yeah, an excellent day. Um, uh, everyone's really thoroughly enjoyed it, and uh, it's been an absolute pleasure to lay on this day for everyone again. I must be honest, I've got it a bit wrong today. Walking around the lakes, uh, I thought Preston Innovations were doing okay, but I never thought they'd have that 
high score needed to uh, to take the win but a great set of anglers a really good set of anglers local knowledge it just goes to show today if you can go on a venue suss it out and and, and deliver on the big events you can win these team matches um, they've just done fantastic again Gab Lino was in the mix my team Joseph James Law was there or thereabouts with uh, two section wins uh, but yeah those lads are awesome and they know what they're doing they put a lot of preparation and time in um, and they deserve it and uh, celebrity signing for Joseph James Law, Grant Albert this year, the match winner. Grant Albert, um, he's fished for us a couple of times now and he's just done fantastic. He's very, very consistent. Um, he uh, went, he fished a lake he's never fished before. He just kept things really simple um, and executed it absolutely unbelievably. And yeah, I was really glad to see him with that lake and match win today. Okay, so fishing hat off, business hat on. Yep. Joseph James Law, how are things going? Uh, things are going really well. Uh, we've had another uh, really busy year. Uh, we've created some new um, uh, trading styles, which uh, have gone really, really well. In particular, we've uh, created a, a brand, myflightdelay.com, uh, which is dealing with quite low value uh, flight claims for our clients. And we've been able to go to number one in the country in that area. And um, we act for about 200 new clients a day. Uh, in particular in, in, in travel um, with last year we acted for about 24,000 passengers so uh, really um, enhanced the firm uh, we've grown we're now uh, nearly 48 people within the firm uh, stretching three offices uh, Leeds Stockton uh, and our um, head office in Milton Keynes Excellent. so it's been a fantastic year um, and we're just really happy that we can still have the time to come and lay this event on this guy can't be thanked enough there's not many firms uh, in the angle, in the outside the angling sector, should I say, that get behind events in it and actually put money into it. So any legal requirements, anything you need, Joseph James Law is the place to go. I'm even using them myself for a couple of things at the minute. So he's the man to get in touch with. Thank you. We we'll look forward to seeing you if you do need any help.